This is the funeral procession of Mr. Lim Ho Pua. I think in those days, even a funeral procession is supposed to be a form of celebration. You have to do it in a dignified way to celebrate the person's next journey to another place and you have to give them a good send-off. That's why it appears to be festive. You just look at how long the procession is. There's so many flags and these are words of consolation or wishes for a good afterlife and things like that. Well, the funeral of Lim Ho Pua has always fascinated me and to actually see it, you know, it's so exciting. He had what was described as one of the grandest funerals in Singapore for that time. Oh, there's something I can see quite clearly. It's called Fuk On Assurance and Go Down Company Limited and something that says they sell rubber stamp and Chinese type manufacturers. And then in Chinese word on the pillars, it says they sell European and American products. So these are all in, uh, yeah, possibly in the Chinatown area. This looks like early day departmental store. Quite often, the cost of the funeral would be higher than what a child might have been bequeathed. At that time, a funeral could cost $10,000, when a shop house could be $4,000. So, you know, it was a lot of money. 